Hey, Steve Noble and Noble Moto here. Uh, got a product review for you today. Picked up a new AGV K3 SV helmet, um, 2X uh, size. I believe this is a medium round, or sorry, what is it? Round oval. Round oval is the helmet shape that's considered. Um, it's a pretty nice helmet. Uh, I'm very happy with it. Um, as you can see, I already got some stickers on the thing. Um, there's been very little wind noise with the thing. It's a pretty quiet... God damn you. Try it again. Hey, Steve Noble, Noble Moto here. Uh, I've got a product review for you today. I picked up an AGV K3 SV helmet. Uh, it's a pretty nice full face helmet. I'm really impressed with this thing. This is actually the second one of these I've owned. Um, I tried on a bunch of other helmets uh, after my last AGV had expired and I ended up buying the exact same helmet again. It fits so well and it works so well. So I have a lot of miles on this thing, even though this is technically a new helmet. Or I have a lot of miles on this model, even though this is technically a new helmet. Uh, it has very little wind noise. Uh, I have a Cardo Pack Doc Bold headset on this thing and I can hear really well. The intercom works really well because there is very minimal min wind noise to this. Now, I do have the ST here with the half fairing on it, so that does help, but I have ridden this thing even on sport bikes and even some naked bikes with zero wind protection, and I was still really pleased with the minimal amount of wind that comes off of this thing. All the vents work really well, get good circulation. Um, it comes with the internal flip-down visor. Whoop, ta-da! So the visor lens, the internal visor lens is pretty clear. Uh, my last one had a bit of a haze to it, which always kind of bothered me, but this one's a little bit better. I do wish I could get a yellow visor for this because uh, I'm in Northern Ohio and I travel a lot around the East Coast and we do get a lot of overcast days and a yellow visor would really be a nice feature for this thing. So AGV, hint, hint, if you're watching this. Um, I believe this is a round oval helmet is the design, the head shape they have. Um, I have a giant head. Uh, I have a hard time fit, finding hats that fit. Uh, this is a 2X, but this giant uh, helmet does fit my giant head pretty well. Even have good chin clearance and stuff. As you can see, I already got some speed stickers on the thing. Uh, you know, you got to shout out to your friends. And uh, yeah, very nice helmet. Nice snap open and close visor on there. I already had it in the rain once. Uh, seals up very well around the thing. My neighbor's dog is barking for no reason, so you got that going on in the background right now. And uh, it's been a nice, good helmet. Uh, I've, I guess you could say I broke it in a little bit. Um, it still retains the same shape and fit really well. There wasn't much size difference from brand new to broken in, so I'm very happy with that. The headset went on it very easily. Uh, the liners just snap in and out of the thing, so make for easy removal for cleaning. Um, the speaker pockets are in a very good location, uh, so they, you know, work very well. There's no weird poking or anything. It has nice clearance on the side of your head for sunglasses or uh, prescription eyewear. So yeah, uh, five-star product. Very happy with this thing. Highly recommend it. Um, yeah, that's all I really have for you today. So if you're in the market for a helmet, highly recommend this one, especially for the round oval heads, uh, people like me. That's all I got. Sorry about the dog.